Hello, 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 ladies and gentlemen, it's your boy Zeno in the building. In today's video, we are going to address this issue with a reshade in 5M. As you can see, it's blocked. 5.9 is blocked. It's telling me to downgrade. So we are going to go ahead and fix this issue. Uh, stay tuned before we get started. I would like to inform you this video is for educational and entertainment purposes only. If you find any value in this video, which you will, please smash that like button and hit that subscribe button so you can start following my channel. So let's get started. Okay, the first thing we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and delete the old reshade within our 5M application data. So let's head over to there. Um, very easy. Just search for 5M. Uh, right click on it and hit open file location. Right click on it again and click on open file location. Then we're going to double click on here and double click on the plugins folder. And we're going to go ahead and delete all these files. And the next thing we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and download the 5.8 version. Uh, there will be a link in the description for my Discord server. So let's hop over to my Discord and show you where you can download the file directly from my Discord. Okay, this is my Discord right here. As you can see, we also have a support page, so feel free to stay here. Uh, don't forget, when you enter my Discord server, you won't see everything yet. You need to go to sub verification and verify yourself by sending a picture. And then you can scroll down and we can head over to GTA 5 graphics. By the way, a quick note, note on this, we also have installation service for Grand Theft Auto and 5M. If you have any needs of a LSPDFR fully installed service, we can do that remotely. Um, yeah, we're going to go ahead over to the category called GTA 5 graphics. And here you will see uh, where you can download the file directly. So if you click on this, you can go ahead and download the file. Uh, there you have it. The file is downloaded. So let's go ahead and open it up. And let's hop over back to our 5M application folder. So this is our 5M application folder where we just deleted the older reshade. We're going to double click on this folder right here. We're going to copy it. And we're going to paste it right here. And now it's extracting and copying all the files from 5.8. And the next step for us is to open up 5M and see if it is working. 5M is loaded up. Let's hit, let's hit F8. And as you can see, we don't have that anymore. Now we can edit our I and I file and add this right here. So it will uh, activate the reshade. So let's go ahead and do that. So what we need to do is we need to copy right this whole line. And how you can do that easily is to open up log. And this is your log. When you open it up, uh, you can hit Control V on your keyboard and search for reshade 5, what we saw also in the log in 5M. Hit enter and you will be redirected to this line right here. We're going to copy it from here, from the add-ons, until here. We're going to hit Control V or right click on it and hit copy. And the next thing we're going to do is we're going to go over to our 5M application folder. So we're going to go to where we installed the files, click on here, double click on here. And here you can hit enter, enter again, and control V or right click and paste it. And we're just going to delete this right here. So you'll have exactly the same as I have but your ID might be different. Uh, so you don't need to type over exactly what I have right here. And then we can close it down and save it. And now we can launch 5M to see if this is all working for you. So I'm pretty excited for y'all because it took me a while to figure this out. As you can see, it is working, installed successfully. Um, 
might take a moment to load everything up but after it's loaded you can hit the home button boom it's all working so that's about it for this tutorial i hope you enjoyed it i hope you see the value in it if you have any questions about this please leave a comment or open up a support post within our discord server um, also feel free to give me back some feedback as any feedback is very valuable to me um, again thank you so much for watching i hope you enjoyed it and have a pleasant day goodbye